come on in, come on in, come on in. We live on the motherfucking couch after motherfucking work. You is tuned in with two of the motherfucking hottest podcasters in the motherfucking city. I don't give a fuck what another motherfucker is doing. On the couch after work is and will be number one before the end of the year. Mark my motherfucking words. God damn it. You heard what he said. So how y'all doing tonight? Y'all heard what he said. We on the motherfucking couch. We had a nice motherfucking little weekend. Al Nuke came through with the motherfucking Detroit Dreams. Brung the whole city out. If you wasn't out, then that means you ain't part of this motherfucker. You understand me? Point blank, period. If you wasn't out, you was not part of that shit. Yeah. Because everybody that is somebody brung their motherfucking that ass out. You understand me? So come on up in here. Cracking. Like crab legs. We just waiting on y'all to come on up in this motherfucker. I'm glad Jimmy started off talking about the. Uh, the premiere, you know what I'm saying? That's kind of what I want to go into tonight. <clears throat> kind of based on that. That shit was, that shit was everything. Come on up in this motherfucker. Welcome to On The Couch At The Word, the live motherfucking show on YouTube, goddamn me. We officially will be off Facebook very, very soon. Almost text you. I'm gonna work my <laughs> Come on up in this motherfucker. Oh, uh, got this shit, man. You know, we, 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 that come on yesterday because we have went to the movie premiere called Detroit Dreams. It will be out on Tubi next month. June 1st, it'll be out on Tubi. This was some of the, this was the biggest fucking uh, movie premiere I've been to. Uh, we got like a little behind the scenes mm -hmm. footage on YouTube if you want to go back and look at that. On check the it out, page. check it out. <clears throat> but the most important thing I saw uh, outside of the movie was the Thank support. you, Ms. Martin. You know what I'm saying? The support behind the whole thing was amazing. And uh, it's kind of, like I said, it's kind of what I want to go into tonight for our support. Um, ain't nothing wrong with supporting your people. Like, don't, like, get out of, get out your head, fuck them niggas and all that. Like, if you don't have a personal problem with somebody and nobody lost their lives behind nothing, ain't nothing wrong with supporting. Mm -hmm. Like, stop being afraid to go support because you fear what your peers and your friends and shit might think about you. Like that shit was something that motherfuckers definitely should have show up for. You know what I'm saying? If you a part of this culture in Detroit, yeah. whether it be fucking yeah. you own a boutique, you fucking rap, you sing, you dance, you fucking got a studio, you make beats, you You was supposed to have your be, ass out there yesterday. You was supposed to have your ass there. Not and not like on no dick riding shit, but just for the support, like because we we on some shit that Detroit haven't been on. Yeah. Since I've been living, I haven't saw Detroit on the level that we at now, as far as the culture, the hip hop culture. You know what I'm saying? Like we ain't been on this on this tip yet. Like niggas really, really show up and show out. It looked good. Everybody was looking good. It was shout out to all the podcasts that was there. Sure. <clears throat> Shout out to all the people that was there. All yeah, the all the niggas yeah. who was somebody supposed to be no, nah, they somebody. I'm gonna say that they was in the yeah. building. Yeah. yeah, for the few who couldn't make it, I'm sure they had valid reasons. But believe me, they wanted to be there, and they homies is telling them what hell of a time they missed. Mm -hmm. but I'm saying all that to say we gotta keep supporting one another. This was a whole black everything. Do you understand what I'm telling you? I'm talking about from the writer. The actors do, and then you know, no disrespect to the white folks. Candace, what up, though? I'm just saying Candace, to see a whole black me. motherfucking cast, black producers, you know, black writers who put this movie together for this city. It's been multiple movies put out, you know, throughout the city, but this shit was huge, and you should have been there. We got to support each other more. If you missed it, you missed a hell of a motherfucker. I'm gonna tell you like that. It was crowded as shit. And it just showed that we can come together and in support of one another. You know what I'm saying? We keep doing shit like that. They don't have no choice but to motherfucking open this door up even more. We kicking it in slowly with Shoddy. Mm -hmm. 
And if you come in on the motherfucking live like this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? Just hit that like button one time. That's Shut all it's going to take. That's it. Shout out to all the women who Chrissy, support Chrissy, how you doing tonight? Chrissy, bring your ass over to YouTube. Y'all bring YouTube. your ass to YouTube. Y'all. If you're watching my live on Facebook, go down to the pinned comment and come on over to it's YouTube. It's going to bring you right to the live what we're doing right now. Because I ain't going to keep going live. Letting you know, motherfuckers, Tamika, right now. what up, though? Shout out to all the ladies who support the boutiques, the, the chicks who selling weave, who making wigs. Shout out to y'all who go support them black girls. You know what I'm saying? Because we know we don't really run that industry, but we run that industry, if that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Shout out to y'all to go support them girls. I mean, I hear a lot of boys like, I, they selling it for that? Fuck that. Go support or open up your own business. You're going to go spend right. that same shit somewhere else. So go spend it with your people. I get it. The customer service might not be on a hundred all the time, but we still learn it. We learn how to we learn how to do business as we do business. You know exactly. what I'm saying? So you know, give us the same fair chances that you give all the other these motherfucking races. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we might make a hiccup sometime and and, and do I don't want to say bad business, but just you know, do something that you might not feel is to your standards as a customer. But give us a chance to make it right and do better next time. T, what up though? T, baby. Don't just abandon your people on, you know, one thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, because you done bought spoiled meat somewhere before, but I'm sure you went and bought groceries again. From that same store. From the same store. store. You know what I'm saying? If not cool, but I'm just saying, give, give your folks a fair, a fair chance in, in business. Because we definitely elevating. You know what I'm saying? My main thing for tonight is support, 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 support. Support Chrissy, what up though? She here. Chrissy done made it over. Stop spending your money with them other motherfuckers. I mean, it's some shit we go to them for, but I know somebody who do everything. Diamond, how you doing? (laughs) You know what I'm saying? From fixing cars. The only thing I don't know is a nigga who own a black grocery store. Other than that, I know yeah. somebody who know how to do anything else. We yeah. even got chicks getting opening up the black beauty supplies now. They got the mobile beauty supply. Let's keep applying this pressure. We can't. We can only apply pressure if we getting the support from y'all. Right. And again, if y'all want to support, y'all want us to uh, shout y'all businesses out and shit. Let us know. We ain't got no problem doing that. Mm-hmm. We love uplifting our people and showing support like y'all y'all do to us. And one thing I notice in life is the black race, the black community is only like 12 to 13 percent in America. But when I tell you it's the number one dollar that's being spent. So if y'all take that math and motherfucking add in the support what Rue is talking about, mm-hmm. we will own a lot of shit. Fuck you see yeah. what I'm saying? The whole point is we not coming together to try to make some generational wealth. You understand me? Motherfuckers is just being stingy and, and greedy out in this motherfucker and wanting, wanting more and more without trying to help All right, as Trent. much as you want. You understand me? Yeah, like motherfuckers be withholding information that can help another motherfucker elevate. Like, it's like they want to charge you for information. Like, Good job, you know, what's going on, my dog? That shit is retarded. Tonight. That shit is retarded to me. I love to help people. Like, yeah. yeah. Any um, motherfuckers who come in my shop and want to build their brand and they want to know the marketing scheme and how could they get this, they did. I give them like the lowest price I can possibly give them to help them get out here. You know what I'm saying? Because we all the fuck we got. For real, I'd rather spend my money black every day. And not because, you know, I'm racist or no shit. Just because shit. We've been spending our money with them for so motherfucking long. Why not spend it with our own people? Hell yeah, Miss Martin, you and Tina was out there hanging. I seen yeah, y'all. Yeah, we saw y'all party looking cute or whatever. You was out there throwing that thing back too, Trey. Throwing that thing back. We saw your ass. <laughs> T- uh, Tina, what up, though? <laughs> they was partying heavy. Y'all was out there enjoying that good heat. Y'all was looking nice. I'm glad you went say. and got Tina up out the motherfucking house. That's right. I'm glad to see y'all together. That's dope. That is dope. <laughs> They was turning up. I couldn't even say nothing because I'm in jail. But I saw y'all for sure, though. She was throwing it back, seeing it like a motherfucker. We was like, look at them couch potatoes down right, there. Right, look at them old Enjoying they sell. Y'all was looking like little <laughs> cute red skin potatoes. You know? 
T, what up, though, cuz? Thanks for tuning in. If you're just tuning in, hit that motherfucking like button one time for hit your that man. Like button. And share it to Facebook from here, y'all. Share it. Hit the little arrow. Yeah. It's going to show you share how to share it. You can phone. share it to wherever. Please share it to Facebook right now. I'm in jail, so I can't really do much promo. Jimmy is only one person, so we need y'all help. You know what I'm saying? Please share this motherfucking live. Real shit. I got 20, like 23 more days before I can do anything. We need y'all. Mika, how you doing tonight? How many of y'all trying to start your own business or like, you know, just become an entrepreneur? How many of y'all trying to do that? We definitely need somebody to share this bitch to the group. On the couch group. Share this bitch to the group. Yes, please share it to the group. Uh, we missing a lot of potatoes that ain't been coming <laughs> on the show and shit. <laughs> The fuck? Y'all getting cooked out in that motherfucking eight, I see. <laughs> I can share it. Hold on, real real TV says. Say y'all ain't lying when y'all were talking about Trey when she went out there for the main reason. Oh, yeah, for sure, Tina. What'd she say? Say y'all weren't lying when y'all was talking about Trey when she came to the meeting brief. She is a lot of fun. Yeah. She is. Trey is definitely uh, fine. She got a nice vibe to herself. Tiffany, how you doing tonight? Go down to the pen comment. Go on over to YouTube. You know what I'm talking about? We live on YouTube right now. If you're right. watching my motherfucking Mother live on Facebook, now. go to the pen comment. Go over to YouTube. Subscribe and hit the notification bell. Tell you the time, but I'm trying to start a podcast. Just order my equipment. And I just need to pull the trigger. I'm pull the trigger. Smoke. Let's fucking go. That's how you got to do it. You just got to do shit. Gotta Don't be do waiting. It. Don't be waiting. If you, you want to do, do something, it. just fucking do it. I just made a post about that, Tina. The longer <laughs> you sit on your shit, the, the, the longer you're going to be sitting on your shit. Fuck that. Don't worry about what nobody's going to think about you. Just do you. If you want to do a podcast, team, to turn that shit on and start recording. You feel me? I'll tune in for sure. Mm-hmm. Don't talk be ner shit nervous on your about what? Network. <laughs> you don't be nervous. Ain't shit to be nervous about. You could be you. One thing about your platform, you can be you, you ain't got a front for nobody. You don't got to do nothing. If a motherfucker don't like what you're doing on your channel, they can get the fuck out of there. Go down to the bottom, pin comment, go on over to YouTube, subscribe and hit the notification bell. We over on YouTube. If you're watching my live right now, go down to the motherfucking pin comment and come on over to YouTube. Hey, y'all, our city was showing out so bad last night. Listen, when I tell you, it was uh, fucking Maybachs and big-ass sprinters. and It was crazy down there last night. I said it. Three days ago, Tina. It was crazy. You don't have to be great to get started. But you do have to start to, to be, be great. great. That's a fact. You got to start to be great. That's why I do so many different things. Because something going to take off. Something got to take something off. Something got to take off. You Shit. know what I'm saying? It's inevitable. If you, if you don't, listen, if you don't take a chance, how, you, how would you know if you... Who's able to be successful with it? Right back to the chances we was talking about two days ago. Got to take that chance. <clears throat> and don't even think failure. Don't think about the worst that can happen. Because one thing about being an entrepreneur is going to be ups and downs. So don't think about, man, this shit might not. No, you got to put that positive off. energy in the atmosphere. No, let's go pop off. You got to say, listen, shit. my shit about to pop off. Yeah. Wendy, what up, though? Wendy, how you doing tonight? Y'all are alive. Again, how many of y'all trying to start y'all own work. business? How many? How many of y'all trying to start y'all own business, create a hustle outside of your job, like to get something going where you can quit work? How many of y'all really want to step out on, you feel me, doing your own motherfucking thing? Right, right. Me? Candace, you know I'm waiting on you to do it. Oh, for sure, Mizzle. Ain't nothing wrong with that, my baby. For I sure, Mizzle. I want to watch it. You know what I'm saying? Wanna watch it just but I'm just it. letting you know, we going to be off Facebook real soon, my baby. I look a little more handsome on the big screen. You feel me? You watch it on the 50, 60 inch, I'm looking handsome. <laughs> you can see my cute features on my ugly self if you're watching me on the big screen. I want to get my own food truck. What's stopping you, baby? 
Or are you moving forward? Okay, for those who are trying to start a business, are you guys moving forward on trying to get to the next levels? You know what I'm saying? Whether mm -hmm. it's researching, because all that's positive movement. If you wake up researching on the next move you need to make, make you know what I'm saying? Make calls and figure out, right, as long right. as you're doing something towards... yeah. Every you feel day. me? Every day. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, Other than yeah. that, you don't want no business. Right. You just playing. <laughs> you playing. So stop saying you want to do it and just start doing it. You know what I'm saying? That's Hey, Candace, that's the plus side. You research. That's the plus side for that's sure. That's the plus side. Because a lot of people just jump out their head first without no research. Mm -hmm. You definitely got to do Yeah, exactly, T. One step at a time. You know what I'm saying? It might take two years before you get your business off the ground and start it. But you got it started. You see what I'm saying? And you know every aspect of it because it took you time to do the research mm -hmm. and rub elbows with motherfuckers that's in that field so you can learn some shit. You see what I'm saying? See, I hate that we had to go to school and learn about all the bullshit that we didn't learn about and they ain't teach us the real shit. You see what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Mm -hmm. That's what give other races the up on us. Because us as black, all we get is public schools. Most motherfuckers get, uh, 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 what's that, private, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, that shit still don't be teaching you what we really need to know about living in this world when we get adults. You see what I'm saying? Yes, That's sir. why so many black folks end up with bad credit, name fucked up, all type of shit because we don't know. All we know is, nigga, shit, they say they gonna give me 10000 nigga, hell yeah, use my social security number now, nigga. Now they using your social security number for everything else. Right. You see what I'm saying? They done ran up 100000 on your name and all you got is 10000 Nigga, that's 10% of your motherfucking name that you done sold. God damn it. Motherfuckers gotta think, man. I mean, shit, I was the same way. I, that's why I know. I'm speaking off experience. You see what I'm saying? But now I got my shit together. Bitch. So it's a different motherfucking ball game now. Yeah. Gotta turn the fuck up, yo. Listen, believe in what the fuck you... The ideas you got... <clears throat> You got to start believing in the idea. You know what I'm saying? Like, believe that you can wake up and get further and further on what, you, on, on what you're trying to do. Because if not, just keep on going to work. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Keep going to work. Yeah, Tina, in a way, but a lot of that shit be gimmicks and games too, man. You go to all them damn different motherfuckers that be talking about businesses because they successful at what they do or whatnot you pay thousand dollars for the class and shit and you basically learning some basic shit about it it ain't like he telling you a secret or 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 he giving you a, a loophole you see what i'm mm -hmm. saying that motherfucker giving you the basic shit man and you done paid a thousand dollars for this class like the fuck shiny how you doing tonight shiny what it do my baby For sure. I, listen, exactly, T. I ain't that's, never that's, afraid to kick out that info. You feel me? As long as I know you serious about what you're doing, and I, I ain't just talking to you just to be talking. You serious about what's going on? I don't mind sharing what I know. On Facebook right now, go down to the pinned comment. Motherfucking come over to YouTube. Subscribe and hit the notification bell. We gonna be off this bitch in a minute. So you better get your ass over here with the action at. Yeah, damn. I'm telling y'all, long God willing, I ain't gonna be working for nobody no more. You feel me? If I can't do tattoos, I can do some other shit. If I can't do some other shit, I can do some other shit. I'm funny, how? <laughs> funny? I'm funny to you? No matter what. Do I look I'm funny to you, motherfucker? To I'm funny, how? Huh? Tell me how I'm funny. <laughs> Listen, you gotta know we some strong people, y'all. Like we strong, we athletic, we motivated, and we come from nothing. So that should be all of the motivation to want to be great, greater than great. You feel what I'm saying? 
Believe me, I know Quarter everybody in this motherfucker then got ideas and you just said to yourself, damn, I want to do this. I want to open up this. I want to... What's guy. stopping you from doing it? on over to YouTube. You? You stopping yourself show. from doing it. You know what I'm talking about? Go down to the pinned comment. You know what I'm saying? Hit the subscribe saying? button. Stop holding yourself back button. from being motherfucking great because that's the only thing that's keeping you from being great is you. Stop being afraid to motherfucking start the path of being great. You got a brick wall in front of yourself. With all these ifs and goddamn, what if I, but if I, fuck the butts and the if, man, just go hard, man. Knock that wall down and start trucking like you've been doing all your life. If you ain't hit the like button, hit the like button one time. All you gonna have to do is hit it one time for the night and you're done. That's right, hit that like button if you ain't hit that like button yet. Get the motherfucking likes up, y'all. Please get them likes up for me one time for the one time. Cause this shit, I'm a, hey, I'm a monster out here. <laughs> sure, I'm trying Wendy. to be a, even more of a monster than that. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get to me some motherfucking dollars on some legit shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got to sell dope. I ain't got to do none of that shit. I'm going off pure Nephew, what up, hustle bro? and motherfucking Come talent. Come over to the YouTube. And I ain't knocking nobody who hustling. Pen I'm just saying. Right I'm doing there. what I do. Right there. Hit that pen comment. LaPresha, come over to the pen comment, baby. We on YouTube. Motherfucker, subscribe and motherfucker hit the notification bell. Hit that fucking like button. There's too many of y'all in here for them likes not to be up, Hit man. them hit likes, them get, like them buttons, lights, get them what? likes, get what? them I'm likes, get them likes. I'm about to turn this shit off, man. I'm, I'm tired of playing with y'all. Hit them get like them buttons, likes, man. Get them likes, get them likes. It don't cost nothing. It's free to hit the like button. It's free. If y'all fuck with us, man, hit that motherfucking like button. And y'all can go look at the little premiere. We got some uh, behind-the-scenes footage, a little video up, too, on YouTube. You know, we had to watch. pull something out for the couch. Yeah, the, and we got, couch some more for coming too. we got some more footage coming yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't hit that like button, hit that like button right now. <laughs> Make sure you say the date, July 2nd. The motherfucker hey, on the couch fan picnic. Hey, I told him, my dog. You we, seen it, T? We ain't hiring no motherfucking cameraman yeah. no more, my <laughs> baby. Fuck that, nigga. Shit, yeah, you understand me? That's all off of that. Because that motherfucker was looking crispy, ain't it? You smell me? Yeah, check that footage out, Tina. You'll see, y'all will see how many people was in there and how much support was in that motherfucker. Y'all, I ain't just talking. Y'all will see it for yourself. Just go check out the video I posted a few hours ago on, on, on the couch page on YouTube. Mm-hmm. And share it to me. Share it, share it, not to me, but share it to the uh Share it around. And shit, y'all, please. I don't know how to respond to that. Kyle, Siri, what up, though, my dog? Shit. Goodbye, Go down Siri. to that pin comment, my dog. Go over to YouTube, subscribe, hit the notification bell, man. We ain't gonna be on Facebook. They be with that restriction shit. Motherfucker, you know, Mark Zuckerberg be taking <clears> his <throat> goons on me, putting me in jail for 30 days. Nigga, I think I've been in jail 30 days the most on Facebook, dog. But anyway, come on over to YouTube. You know what I'm talking about? I appreciate you, my dog. Man, the movie premiere was motherfucking dope. You understand me, Wendy? That's what he's saying. Go and watch the video. We got we got a video on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Coney Street Grill. Oh, that's your family. That's what's up, Wendy Jones. Yeah, they, they was a uh, sponsor of that motherfucker. Yeah, that's what she said. That's what's up. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm saying. That Appreciate you, my supporting. baby. The city was fucking supporting. Yeah, that Detroit Dream shit was the shit. You know what I'm saying? Everybody that was somebody was in that motherfucker. You understand me? Yeah, yeah. It wasn't even an argument in that bitch. At all. Not even a fist fight, not nothing. You know what I'm saying? That shit is beautiful, man, when the city can come together all as one and have motherfucking fun. We posted the video. She said, when y'all post that video? What was that? About three hours About ago. About three hours ago. Yeah, that shit was fun as hell. I ain't even gonna lie. Yeah, that shit was dope. I'm looking I'm looking forward to doing more shit like that. That's what we gonna show up in all the shit that matter. If it don't matter, we not there. Yeah. When that shit come, yeah. we will be in that motherfucker. We gonna be in the motherfucking building because it ain't a place we can't go. You yeah. understand me? And you know what's a good thing about this movie, y'all? Damn near everybody in the city really played a part, like literally. Yeah. From from the niggas who made the clothes, the niggas who provided the music, mm -hmm. the niggas who provided the locations for them to be at. Shout out to my you nigga know? Byron. 
don't BB's know where dying he to shout out to them too. That nigga, he had the old school rise in that bitch for the beginning when Hurt was, got killed yeah. and shit. Yeah. Nova Noah, we over there on YouTube, my baby, but how you doing tonight? Y'all the hashtags, Al Nuke, Tone Tone. Those yeah. Detroit artists, who was it? Uh, Al Nuke is the guy who wrote and produced right. the movie and directed it. Tone Tone, Tone, Tone wasn't even artist. in it. Tone Tone, well, he, he wasn't in it, but he, yeah, he, he, yeah, his restaurant was in it. His restaurant was in it. No, he was in it. Yeah, he was in it. Yep, yep. He uh, was about to rob the artist. He was in that motherfucker. Oh, all right, all right, all right. That was him, dude. But yeah, those are um, Detroit icons, you know what I'm saying? Like, them boys... Been putting in a lot of work in this city, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I hashtag them. You can click on them hashtags and you'll see a lot of Detroit music and shit that they doing too. That's why I put those hashtags there. Right, right, right. What's about the Detroit Dreams? That's the name of the movie, Detroit Dreams. So you can click on that and probably see the trailer and shit like that. Mm -hmm. So I was just putting them hashtags just so y'all can so see real, It's shit definitely did. a real good movie, y'all. You know what I'm saying? It, it's going to be one of them ones where you can go back and watch it over and over and over. You feel mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Pretty good movie, man. They had a nice storyline. Everybody did they acting like they were supposed to. And the quality to. is good. And like it's the not quality just no, of it. Yeah, it was shot with that red cam. Yeah, it's not just no, shit. you know, $50,000 camera, motherfucker. And not knocking shit. the hood movies, but like you can tell they put some, they put some, spend some money on it. Oh shit, yeah. I'm about to say, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Tina, what the fuck you talking about? But yeah, she talking to Chris. Happy motherfucking Monday, y'all. I know this is the worst day of the week. Everybody hated to get up and go to motherfucking work. That's why I'm saying it's time to start doing businesses. Yeah, I feel you, Minka. I've been liking a lot of Detroit movies. movies. Yeah, you know what? <clears throat> it's getting better and better and better the and better. The only thing I can say about Detroit Dreams is I hate that they didn't have murder pain in that bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he is the murder. top motherfucking actor in the city. I don't give a fuck yeah, if you don't like him or, or not. He is the top actor because he actually put his all into that shit, man. Shout out murder pain. Shout out motherfucking murder pain, man. That's my baby. But, we, um, we don't yes. really know if they tried to get him in or not, but we we wish we could have saw him. Man. Yeah, like, that would have yeah. that would have definitely made that like, would have yeah, set it yeah, off. Like, yeah, yeah, that would have set it off for real, for real. That would have showed even more camaraderie that we got, and I'm seeing that. I will say that, like motherfuckers, is starting to fuck with each other a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? It's time to put that beef shit aside for those who got beef yeah. drama. Put that shit aside. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, if ain't nobody lost their lives, nothing behind nothing, man, let that shit go. Let it, let it go. It's a bigger purpose, you know what I'm saying? The kids looking at us, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. The kids is looking at us. They looking at the hip-hop culture, how we dress, how we act, how we move, how we dance, how we talk. Yeah. You know what I mean? We are the ones that's raising the next generation, man. Whether y'all want to believe that or not. So how you motherfucking pertain and keep yourself up around these streets is how a motherfucker go view you. You know what I'm saying? You might got somebody, a little kid looking up to you and, and you showing them the bad route because you doing all the wrong shit. You know what I'm saying? You beefing on Facebook with motherfuckers. You out here showing ass and titties like a motherfucker, <laughs> but little niece looking up to you because you auntie. You see what I'm saying? Y'all got to think about how y'all move, man. You know what I'm saying? That's why I had to stop a lot of shit I was doing because I got a lot of nephews. And I ain't want them to grow up like how the fuck I motherfucking came up. You know what I'm saying? So shit, I motherfucker started teaching them good shit. You know what I'm saying? Showing them instead of just motherfucking telling them. Exactly. Because That's when I, you show a motherfucker, they learn more better. Because well, it's like a memory put example. in their motherfucking head to be like, oh yeah, all right. That's how it's supposed to be Bebo, done. Big bro, what up with it? Yeah, you got a motherfucking list. That's why I, I like the fact that I got my own business and shit. So when I'm preaching to the young niggas, I'm leading by example. They seeing what I'm doing. I ain't just talking. You know what I'm saying? I'm actually doing what the fuck I'm preaching to them. You know what I'm saying? Showing them a, a different way than just doing goofy shit out here. You know what doing I'm saying? stupid <clears throat> shit. Hit that like button. If you ain't hit that like button and you watching this live, hit that motherfucking like button. Get them likes up, y'all. We appreciate y'all so much. Pull up, Debo. 
That's Debo. Yeah. Mr. What up, Bills? You know I gotta talk my shit. Nigga, you ain't here right now, but nigga, when you pull up, I'll be quiet. <laughs> but when you leave, I'll be talking, talking again. again. <laughs> pull up, bro, if you ain't doing nothing. Shit, that nigga pull up, I gotta take my chain. Tuck my chain in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they be doing too much. You better watch who your kids hanging out with. I want to start my little 10 year old her own little clothing line lip gloss I want to do all that kind of shit you know what I'm saying show her early cause she see her daddy and her mama got their own business her mama got a right, boutique right. and daddy so got his own shop so she should have one right now mm -hmm. going so I'm exactly. trying to make it to where all she knows is like we business owners, ain't no, nah. Yeah. I'm gonna go to school, get this education, but I'm learning how to do business. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. At an early age, she 10. By the time she get 15, she gonna be knowing how to do some shit. Right. And she gonna be having some shit. And she gonna be having some shit. Shit. I don't do business. Yeah, they do be. And I that's agree. good. That's I good. Agree. My little nephew, uh, Mr. Williamson, he got his own clothing line. Yeah. Broke boy. You know Broke boy saying? shirts I be wearing and shit. That, he yeah. he popping. He making noise in the city. He yeah. a young, young, young nigga. Oh, let's go take it for another year or two and, and it's over. the right motherfucker wear his shit, nigga, and he out of here. Yeah, he consistent. You see what you I'm know saying? What I'm saying? He, ever yeah. since he started doing it, he yeah. haven't stopped. He, he got multiple exactly. colors, multiple designs. Yep. He stand on top, on top, on top. Because consistency <clears throat> is the motherfucking key, y'all, no matter what the fuck you do. Whether it, slow motion is better than no motion. Yeah, Always yeah. remember that. You know what I'm saying? So long as you stay in consistent Seen with something, what I've done, you go start seeing something. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. Shida, Shida, how Hell you yeah, doing Hell yeah, you already know. You know we trying to build something here? Shit, that's nephew. Hell yeah. That's motherfucking nephew. He know nephew. I'll pop up on this ass anyway. You ask some shit. <laughs> you feel me? We, we got to make sure we promote that shit too. <laughs> That's all I'm about anyway. I, I've been in business for myself for a long time now, so all I know is out the mud, supporting others, trying to help others build, who's serious. Man, That's all I know. Shout out to my mm. nigga Street Life VS. That nigga called me Mr. Support Everybody. Goddamn. Because <laughs> that motherfuckers know Jimmy coming through. You understand me? For sure. And I'm definitely going to support the motherfucking cause because that's how it's supposed to be because I ain't got a jealous bone in my body. I want to see everybody eat. You understand me? Yeah, yeah. We got motherfuckers got all these restaurants and shit. Nah, everybody doing something. So y'all just keep on supporting your motherfucking people. I don't give a fuck. Keep supporting. They going to get better and better at what they doing. You know what I'm saying? Just keep on supporting as much as you can. Put that motherfucking dollar back in the motherfucking And if you community. know something better than them, then all the fuck you got to do is... Motherfucker, teach them. Tell them in a nice way. You ain't got to be mean. You ain't got to be sarcasm with it. You know what I'm saying? No, nah, you ain't got to. Shit, just motherfucking let them know. Hey, look, man, you're doing it wrong, dog. I know a better way you could be doing this. Whoop, 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 and bam. There you go. You know what I'm saying? We now, try, Debo. Nah, nah, they go motherfucking take your uh, motherfucking advice and move on with making money in life. And you go motherfucking go on about your life being... Happy knowing that you done helped the motherfucker instead of downing them, making long pulses, talking shit about them because they done fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Everybody fuck up. We all human, y'all. I don't give a fuck how much a motherfucking money a motherfucker got. Materialistic shit, none of that shit matter to me because at the end of the day, if I shoot that motherfucker, he gonna bleed just like me. Well, you understand me? Sheena, if you wanna uh, support Broke Boy, go to go on Instagram to Broke Boy Enterprises. Spell everything correctly all together. Broke Boy Enterprises. And he gonna come right up. You know what I'm saying? You'll see it. It's a like Broke Boy, he got like, it's sweet. You'll see it. Yeah, yeah. He got some nice shit over there. He got girl shit, guy shit. You know what I mean? Consultant is also a big business. Absolutely. You know what? Motherfuckers be telling me that, team. They be like, you should charge people. But I I be feeling weird, like, charging people for knowledge. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know everything. But if I can share a little bit of what I know to you and it can help you be better at what you're doing, it don't cost me nothing. Exactly. And you're going to exactly. always remember me. I ain't looking for yeah. no money. 
yeah. from you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, but you're right though. It's definitely big business. Definitely big business. There it go right there, bro. Boy Enterprises. Right. T, T the shirt just... guy, the one that is fucking manufacturing <clears throat> the clothing for him. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So hey, we we networking yeah, we like networking. a motherfucker. We work together around this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? That's what I mean by support. Motherfuckers ain't trying to be stingy, man. It's enough money for everybody. It's too much for really everybody. Right, it's too much. You know what I'm saying? Because all the billionaires, if they just went all the way down to just 10 million a piece, yeah, look at all them extra billions out there for the world to eat Man, off of. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Everybody wouldn't be broke, is all I'm saying. So at the end of the day, Kev, come on over to YouTube. Hit the pin comment, dog. Come on over, my nigga. Right, subscribe. Hit the, hit the, hit the comment at the bottom. Shit. But yeah, man. Motherfuckers wouldn't be broke out here, man. But motherfuckers are stingy and greedy, y'all. You right, though. But I, 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 you are exactly right, Tina. I'm just saying, like, when I be talking to people who trying to build something, I, I don't even be thinking, like, damn, let me charge them. I just be... It, it start with a conversation. You know what I'm saying? And then we just... It go from there. And they be like, you know, I was thinking about what a logo. What I'm What's this crazy, and then now I'm okay. Well, I do logo. I make a few dollars on over the YouTube, my baby. It's hard for me to we charge you for information. Subscribe and motherfucking hit the, but I will. the notification bell. I just baby. don't be thinking about it. You feel me? If you ain't hit the motherfucking like button, hit the like button one time for me. You know what I'm saying? You know, we always go drop knowledge on y'all. We go motherfucking make y'all laugh. We go have a good time in this bitch. Work so out, get some black just hit the like too. button. That's all I ask. You know what I'm saying? Shit, you got. Uh, we fuck with, uh, 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 Hot Wheel City. If you want some rims, I, I prefer you to buy them brand new. You're a woman. Yeah, I don't know how right, niggas be yeah, trying to gank yeah, you for yeah, used rims. Yeah. Hot Wheel City. Hot Wheel baby. City, you probably can get some nice 22s brand new with the tires mm -hmm. for probably like 2200 yep. Maybe yep. 2000 Maybe 2000 exactly. Some nice black rims. Hell yeah. At least you would know they'd be brand new. You ain't got to worry about no cracks being in them. You know what I mean? It'll be the first one with that shit. T, I know they don't. That's what I'm saying. They don't want to pay. Because consultation fees cost. So that's why I rock with the people who I know serious. And I get to bless them later on. You know what I'm saying? You don't get everybody the sauce. Because everybody ain't serious about whipping up. Don't let right. that go over y'all head. I'm just saying. <laughs> you can't give everybody the sauce. Because everybody ain't serious about whipping up. If you rock with a motherfucker. And you see they serious about trying to build a clothing line or start a business and, and you know your little game can help them then you do that and don't look for shit in return right because it ain't it ain't, can't stop what you doing you know you giving a little game it ain't stopping what you doing it's elevating it's helping you you learning more you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. you becoming a better business businessman ct say so i just share the info for sure yeah. Because yeah, either you're yeah. gonna, gonna use it or you ain't either way i'm using the info i tried to get to you i'm using it and you see what I'm doing. You in my place of business. Need some service from me. And you trying to provide service to others. I do got a little game for you. Now, whether you use it or not, it's different. <laughs> if you ain't subscribed, subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Because we going to have a lot in store for y'all this year. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I'm letting y'all know now. You want to motherfucking subscribe, because motherfuckers going to be talking about it. You're going to be like, damn, I was fucking with them, but I ain't never subscribed. Yeah, hit that motherfucking subscribe. I ain't subscribe. never subscribed. <laughs> if you ain't subscribed, please make sure you subscribe. I'm telling you, you subscribe don't want to make shit. and hit that notification bell, because without that notification bell, you ain't going to get notified when we upload something new. Y'all y'all at the beginning of this, of this journey with us, you know what I'm saying? Y'all going to be able to be like, shit, we remember when they, we remember when they, Cause we gonna start taking this shit on the road. On the road is what I'm trying sure. to tell y'all. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. But we gonna always be on the couch. We're we'll we'll in the, the seat. Well, we gonna you know what I'm saying? Shit. We're gonna be doing shit other podcasts ain't doing. We're gonna be stepping out here in the streets. Yeah. Fucking with the people. Because we really be out here. You so so if we miss a day, believe me, we out here working and we gonna have footage for y'all for what the day we miss. We gonna have some footage that next day or day or two. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. San Antonio, we, I wouldn't mind coming down there. Yo, what what big event they be having down there in Texas? I don't know, man. San Antonio was really cowboyish when I went down there. Oh, I'm with that. I'm with going down there to put the cowboy hat on. The Houston, cowboy Houston, D hat. They got to give me a cowboy Houston D hat. Houston and uh, DF Dub, that, that was the ghetto part. You know what I'm saying? Houston was more updated. Houston is like the west side of Detroit. DFW, Dallas, and all that. That shit is like Fort Worth. All that shit is like the East Side. Spurs games, <laughs> comedy shows. 
<laughs> For sure. <laughs> we want to go where it's lit at. Like, what type of shit you and Trey was just at? Y'all was at, like, a nice little spot. You know what I mean? It's got to be something to go down in Texas somewhere. I got I got a homegirl lit down there, too. I, I definitely want to come to Texas, for real. We just saying we're going to keep giving y'all content. Like, it's going to stay consistent. We ain't going to let up. If we miss, we got we working. Point blank. Chantel, how you doing tonight? Hit the pin comment at the bottom and come on over to YouTube. Subscribe and hit the notification. Sometimes y'all might just get me talking some shit. Sometimes y'all might just get Jimmy talking some shit on some game. Right quick, five, ten minutes worth of game. We still going to be doing on the couch every night. But, through, you know, you might get a video throughout the day. You never know. Just stay tuned in. You're going to always get notified if you hit the notification bell. You heard me? She said the black side. <laughs> you wasn't hip to the black side. That's where I want to go to the black side. Anywhere I want to, anywhere, any city or state I go to, I want to go to the hood. I want y'all to know this, y'all. You better than what the fuck you think you is. And you a lot stronger than what the fuck you think you is. better than what you think you is. I'm not saying you think the worst of yourself, but just know you are better than what you think you is. Oh, to for sure, Miss Bart. For sure. Shout out show. to Trey's son. For What's show. up, nephew? What's cracking, nephew? How you doing? Uncle, Will, Uncle Jimmy over here. You feel me? <laughs> For real, that's all we do is, is try to get positive energy. We might laugh, talk bullshit, joke, but we be on some positive shit up here in Detroit. Yeah. You know what I'm uh, saying? For real, we hang around grown ass men who trying to do grown ass shit every day. We ain't hang around no low lives who ain't trying to do nothing and further they they life, man. We ain't got time for that. Exactly. That's a that's a bad apple on a tree. Exactly. I don't want you around me if you ain't trying to do nothing with your life. And you ain't got to be at the top of the game, but you trying to move further right. and be better and trying be better. To, trying to be better than you was Yesterday. last week. Hell yeah, because <laughs> nigga. Girl, I do know things take time. Mm -hmm. But in a week's time, if you ain't trying to do better than what you had last week, you just wasted seven days. Mm. <laughs> you got 24 hours to do this shit every day. When you wake up, do something towards bettering your situation. Whatever your situation is, even if you're doing good, still wake up and push forward to make that even better. You know what I'm saying? Every single day. Don't don't lack at all. You feel me? You can do something that's moving towards being better every day. Like I said, if it ain't nothing but a phone call or some research, that's something towards better in your shit. The moment you don't do nothing, you falling back a step. You falling back a step. Mm -hmm. Now you ain't even researching at all. You ain't doing shit. Steady talking about what you about to do. Y'all know them type of people. I'm about to, you know, I was I was finna, I was finna, I was gonna do the same thing. Right. <laughs> I was thinking about, yeah, that's all you've been doing is thinking about. Mm -hmm. You've been thinking about. I'm moving. So them conversations, I be like, yeah, for sure. Cause I know you just talking. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. I'm gonna for sure your ass to death. For sure, my baby. Until you start showing me you moving for real. Mm-hmm. We appreciate y'all in this motherfucker watching this live. Yeah, you understand yeah. me? On the motherfucking couch after work. Because a nigga like me, I'm thirsty for more knowledge and more game. Danny D, how you doing tonight? Uh, Only because I'm self-sufficient. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm on my own. I'm my own boss, so I got to learn Every motherfucking day. I got to learn and get better every day. I don't count on no check every motherfucking week. Man, what? I got to get out here Shit. every single day and what? get mad. So I'm trying to learn and, and, and get game every motherfucking day. I make it look good how I do it, but shit, believe me, y'all. Anybody who's self-sufficient and you you don't work, but you, you live your life, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah. And what I mean by work is punch a clock, because I still got to work, but I'm saying, like, nigga, this shit an uh, uphill battle. Mm -hmm. But I'm getting there. Danny D is about to have her little baby any day, y'all. Danny D, I can bring that uh, gift to you, too. Swine dropped it off. I can yeah, bring it to you. Yeah, got the blanket for you, pregnant. my baby. I don't want you to be going out your way. I can drop it off to you or meet you somewhere. 
I don't want to take you out your way. She about to have the little Just one. Just let me know. I want to make sure you get it. It's nice, too. We about to have a little spud in the house, y'all. About to have a little spud potato. <laughs> The first, but the first uh, potato, cow's potato baby. Right, the first <laughs> cow's potato baby. <laughs> My foot weak, good as hell, boy. All right, just let me know. I got you. I'll shoot my number to you in the um in the messenger. I don't know. I don't know. Y'all gotta mm -hmm. ask him. We ain't got nothing to do with that. Yeah. You understand me? It's not us. Shit. So I don't know. He doing his own thing right now. He, you know, he pulled up on us the other day. Uh, we just gotta keep doing what we do. And what we do is on the motherfucking couch after motherfucking work. You understand me? This was my clothing line, y'all. One of my first shirt through the Jimmy swag. You only die once. Fuck that YOLO shit. It's Yodo. <laughs> Ain't no yeah, coming man. back from death, motherfucker. You only die once, girl. You only die once around this motherfucker. So that, so that dash between your born on and your death date, that, that middle part, you better make the best of that shit. Make the best of that you shit. Feel you feel me? understand me? Don't live your life miserable, sad. And, and, and full of fucked up energy. You better smile. God damn that you woke up. Bring them back, bro. Bring them back. I'm probably go bring them back. That's what I'm saying. We do, do what we want to do. Would y'all fuck with me <laughs> if I brung them back? Y'all, let me Yo, know. Yo, though. Let me you know something. Let me know something. Let me know something. Y'all fuck with me if I bring them back. We do what we want to. I like that. You only die once. Uh, uh, ain't no do overs, my baby. Ain't no, oh, shit, I was just playing, y'all. Shit, I'm back. No, I'm back. I ain't seen not one of my niggas come back. One of my family members, none of that shit. You understand me? I will, Jimmy. I know the cost of potatoes is going to support. And That's what's up, Danny D. See, I love y'all, man. Y'all know me cry over this motherfucking dog. The fuck? But I appreciate that, Danny D. For sure, for sure. Hey, y'all. Again, support, support, support everything that your people doing. If you know some people doing something and you fuck with them, support them. Support them as much as you can. As much as you can. As long as they ain't hurting you and they get they pushing quality of whatever that you purchasing, yeah. support. I ain't saying go out there and buy no fuck shit because a motherfucker black and they your cousin. Nah. Right. If a motherfucker giving you quality, whatever you purchasing, support, support, support. For real, for real. Look, off the J's, what? Everything I wear is off my shoes. I make my own clothes mm -hmm. to match my shoes and hats. That's what I do. Point blank, period. Or wear one of my nigga shirts. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? Got fly shit in the closet, but I prefer to wear my funk shit. When I want to step out, I get fly. Yeah, don't be afraid to win. I can't keep talking. I can't stop talking about this shit. Don't be afraid to fucking win. Because you go take some losses, but that's the only You've way you You've been losing long enough. That's the only way you go learn. You've been losing long enough, just like I done lost long enough. We've been down so long, there's only one way to go. Up. Up. Get up off your ass. Motivate yourself. Fuck looking for people to motivate you. You don't need nobody to validate who the fuck you are. Once you be happy with yourself, people will see that. You know what I'm saying? They'll see they can't move you in the wrong way. They'll see all of that. So they definitely going to support them. Because now you happy with, you, you feel me, with you. you. You can present your shit in a different manner because you happy with it. That's what I be trying to be on. Every motherfucking day. I'm comfortable with the space I'm in, who I am as a man. <clears throat> what I bring to the world and still trying to get better. You know what I'm saying? I ain't perfect. You know, I got a few flaws, but shit, we all do. I just understand that I do. But I'm, I still move forward every motherfucking day.
to be great, greater. Because I could be fucked up. Real fucked up. You feel me? I'm, I'm the real definition of getting this shit out the mud. Man. Duh. Not no PPP, not no SBA, <laughs> no. not no none of that none shit. None of that shit. Not no you can put some money in my account. Not no none of that. Turn All 300 to 3,000. <laughs> then 3,000 to 9,000. <laughs> All that shit, man. Nah, we, hey. I dug, I dug and dug and dug and dug and dug. And and dug. Keep digging. And I'm still digging. <laughs> shit. Shit. And still motherfucking digging. Yes, 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 I am. I am, yes, Candace. <clears throat> Saturday at 7. I'm available. I ain't part of the committee. Ain't that a bitch? They talking about the shot. The fuck? Candace, oh. we go we we go have a talk. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. I'm my left out the Bing committee. Bong. Yeah, y'all, it's money out here to be made. Plenty of it. And all all of y'all got a talent that y'all know y'all got. Y'all just scared to try uh -huh. something. You know what I'm saying? She said, I'm speaking of the shop, sir. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Don't be afraid to get out here and get this paper, y'all. Don't be afraid. I see some, I, listen, I see people, man, 360 boosts, all these different type of cameras that do this and do that. They making money. Like, everybody, man, bitches selling banana pudding mm -hmm. cups. And, man, <laughs> yeah, everybody, man, shit. bro. <laughs> Strawberry shortcakes. Yeah, like, <laughs> it's bread it's out here. Thing, dog. A motherfucker go buy it, man. My sister showed me some shit she doing. They they got the if you got a bald head baby, they they got she got some shit she making nigga that's got beads. It's like little weave with beads on it. It's like a a hair uh, ponytail holder, but it's it's got beads and hair on it. Mm. Some crazy looking shit, but it looks sweet when you put it in the kid head. Like damn, oh that's got little hair. Right. But she it's really just on a little ponytail. Oh, that's for like cancer patients and shit then. No, they doing this shit for little girls who got hair. Even little girls who got hair. The little thing looks so sweet. It's, Damn, it's, that's crazy. I know y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all just saw that shit, ladies. I know y'all saw the little hair. It's like a, uh, damn, what they call the motherfucker? The thing for the hair, y'all, that little knocking ball shit, but it got beads on it. It go on the little ponytail. It like got beads and hair on it. Yeah, this shit look kind of sweet. Yeah, they make everything. That's how creative we are. You know what I'm saying? As black people, we creative than a motherfucker. Support that shit. My sister doing that shit, man. She You got a bald headed baby. <laughs> Go holla at Ruth. <laughs> if your motherfucking kid can't grow hair, <laughs> that motherfucker look like Michael Jordan when he wake up. <laughs> I'm just bullshitting y'all. I'm just technically speaking. You know what I'm saying? Allegedly, like if you got a bald-headed child, okay. I got to say allegedly. <laughs> I feel you on that, Candace. I feel you on that. But you can never lose with that food. You can't lose with that fool when it's good. Long as it's good. Long as it's Long good, as it's you good. can't lose. I wish you start calling me when you cook. Because I will come buy me some plates. No, well, how you doing tonight? No, well, where you pitch at, my baby? <laughs> <laughs> you hiding from us. No well. No well. Yeah, I knew I knew what you were talking about. Mm -hmm. 
But that shit gonna stop though, Candace. It, trust me. Money hit different. Man, trust man, me, that shit gonna stop. Hell yeah, Danny D. Tell him, Tina. <laughs> Shit. Swan going to cut your ass off. <laughs> Ma, he don't owe no explanation. He, listen, one Who thing about... Who do he own the explanation to first? She behind the scenes. Ain't everybody got damn business. <laughs> ain't nothing wrong. Swan is fine. That's our brother. That's it. Right? <laughs> That's all I can tell you. So I'm gonna be like, Tina, what the hell? about us. <laughs> All right. You gonna have y'all some baked <laughs> potatoes up in this bitch. <laughs> Mother's Day next Sunday? This Sunday. This Sunday. Come here. That's what yeah, I mean. This Sunday. Yeah, yeah. Ladies, what y'all doing for Mother's Day? Do y'all got anything planned or, you know, is it something? Something special y'all might want. Any of y'all getting y'all booty leg for Mother's <laughs> Day? <laughs> this nigga retarded. <laughs> uh, I'm just saying, shit, you know, y'all be trying to go all out. I'm gonna give my mama some saying? money. She gonna get some money, man. My mama, she want the money. Oh, I'm definitely motherfucker do. I do for my mama every Mother's Day. Every birthday, all that shit. You know Moms what I'm saying? Mom want the money. Everybody that knows Jimmy knows shit. I love my mama to death. You understand me? Mother's Day is my birthday. Damn, Danny D. Straight up. Oh, Damn. wow. Happy Mother's Birthday. You getting, you getting two gifts. Happy Mother's Birthday. <laughs> he got to go all out. <laughs> birthday and Mother's Day? Shit. Happy Mother's Birthday. Shit. No plans to get my son a toss or steal. Hey, Tina, I heard that dude, uh, 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 Deacon Robinson came on down there and meet you. He's trying to fill up on you. <laughs> <laughs> so he was trying to fill up on you. She talking about, oh, yeah, he's just going to come down. We're going to go to dinner. Remember last year? Yeah. <laughs> Did you meet you something at that party, Tina? No, my man came down and was trying to get on that ass like shit. Like, Hold on, wait a minute. Let me bless the ass. Let me bless the ass. I said, Tina, let me bless your ass. <laughs> you better come stepping or he gone. <laughs> I didn't end it. I, you ain't have to. You put it on Facebook. It is publicly public documented. <laughs> it's public information, my baby. We see it. Do me a favor, y'all. Share this to the face to y'all Facebook page right now, please. Share it live from the YouTube to the Facebook, please. One time for the one time. I appreciate it if y'all could do that for me. Has somebody ever done something to y'all that y'all didn't forgive them for? Anything, family, friends, relationship, anything. Anybody ever done something to you that you never forgave them? Hmm. Or have you, you ever even thought about that? Like having a painting twist with a comedian, live band. When, Jamaica? When? Let me know. Shoot it to my inbox. We, hey, we show up to shit now. Yeah, when is that going to be, Maker? And where is that going to be at? And can I get in with my gun? <laughs> Tomorrow, can I get in with my gun? <laughs> Is it something that you never forgave before? That's the question, y'all. That's the motherfucking question. Is it something I ain't never forgave for? Mm. You? You got something you ain't never forgave for? Or uh, anything? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I forgave, though. I just don't forget about it. No, I'm saying something you never forgave. Like, I can't forget that. Um, I can't forget that. Nope. Hmm. Something that was done to you that you just couldn't forget. 
Oh, she's saying this for Mother's Day, the comedy thing. Ah, uh, my mama might. She might. Can you shoot the information to my inbox? I can get messages on Facebook, but I can't fucking uh, comment and nothing. I can respond back and shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's a, that's a hard one. Yeah, man. Because even if I ain't forgive a motherfucker, I just forget about some shit. Like, I guess that means you forgave him. Like, we just let it go. Like, I'll just be like, I ain't. Yeah. Like, For sure. I feel that nothing is worth holding grudges. Well, I don't know. Trey, it depends. Because what if a motherfucker really just like. Nigga, you know one what I'm time, saying? Nigga, my older sister, nigga, she took my $600 my mama left for me when she went out of town, nigga. I never. I, nigga, <laughs> I ain't forgive her for that shit, nigga. I was, I was eight years old, nigga. I ain't forgive her for, to, for that shit until I was like 36, nigga. Damn. I was about the biggest thing, nigga. I was pissed off, nigga. Mama was gone out of town for two weeks, nigga. She left me $600. And she just went in, nigga. I'm gone with this. That's what I was gonna give my mama some money, too. Sheena. Yeah, they forget so your blessings won't be blocked. I just, man, me. Blessings won't get blocked. I, yeah, I'm about to say, you like, you can't like tell I said, me I, how long to be mad. Yeah, I ain't forget my sister that long, but shit, I was still getting blessed. You know what I'm saying? I'm a fucking, still ain't got no felonies. I still ain't got no kids. You know what I'm saying? I'm from the east side of Detroit at 42 years old. How many niggas doing Y'all better stop holding grudge. It don't really you know be a saying? grudge. It just be more you like a, a fuck you. Yeah. Yeah. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Ain't really no grudge. It's like, yeah. man, fuck you. I ain't nigga. I motherfucking graduated high school, graduated college, shit. I was still getting blessed, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't blessings being blocked. It was just she had, she took my motherfucking money. Money. <laughs> <laughs> ain't no telling what she did with my money. Right. <laughs> <laughs> My way, Jimmy with the college. What? That's hard to believe. Right. The fuck? Niggas ain't dumb around this. Game. <laughs> Business administrator for my baby. Why you think I'm an entrepreneur? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody want to excuse me? I'm hungry. Anybody cook dinner this, tonight? Anybody cook dinner? Anybody out there cooking I'm dinner? I'm out to dinner until tomorrow by or something. Well, let's see something like eat. That's right up your alley. You gonna hey, buy yourself right, something right. too. Right. <laughs> Trey gonna buy herself something, man. Wanna eat? Something. She threw food in there because she gotta eat yeah, something. Yeah, you think you slick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's your day, mama. <laughs> Hubby probably gonna get you together real good. Right. Yeah, you, yeah, you know what you're doing. <laughs> Shout out to all the mothers, man. Shout out know, to all the mothers. Know, if ain't nobody tell you you a, a hell of a mother, we gonna tell you you a hell of a mother. Goddamn, you being the best mama you can be. Right. Y'all carried a goddamn baby for nine months. I think that is a fucking amazing. Um, you know, salute from on the couch of Ruin Jimmy, man. Shout out to the motherfucking mama. Happy early Mother's Day to y'all. We love y'all for real. I'll sing it to him for sure, Mika. Don't lay no hands, Candace. What? Beer, batter, shrimp, white and fries. Sounds good. Ah, uh, that, uh, that's, that's what's up, Shiny. Damn, I'm sorry about that, though, too. Sorry to hear about that, but that's what's up. You, that, you know what I'm saying? That shit got to hit different. Yeah. I wouldn't be as happy as you be. I'm going to just let you know that now. <laughs> you carry it so well. Yeah, That's how I know you stronger than what you think you are. Shiny, super strong. She got six spots left. I'm gonna call my mama and see if she wanna go. Mm -hmm. How much the tickets? I'll buy a ticket though, even if she don't wanna go, just to, just to support. Anyway, I definitely do that. Thirty dollars. Send me your cash. Tamika, is it $30 or $50? What that say at the bottom of there? Look like a three. 
Send me your cash out right now for the purchase of ticket right Murray now. Is here. You were shaking while you took that picture? <laughs> Gonna be in there, Marvin Gaye. <laughs> no, just talking Is shit. They gonna have Stevie in that bitch <laughs> with the hair cut off. <laughs> yeah, Stevie wanted to cut his hair, y'all. Y'all saw that? <laughs> Did y'all see my nigga Stevie? Allegedly, allegedly, Stevie cut his hair off, y'all. You know what I'm saying? We got to throw that out there, you know what I'm saying? Know, we on YouTube. Let me see. Yeah, bro. I know, but we still got to say allegedly. Allegedly. We on YouTube now. Nah, okay. We ain't trying to get sued. I'm about, to... <laughs> I'm about to go look. Let me see. I got, I got to go see, man. <laughs> Let me see. Seen the same. My nephew did the unthinkable. It's been four years since we not still speaking. Who said that? Shana. Oh, nephew did the unthinkable. It's been four years. Damn, played the unthinkable. Damn. Damn. So, see, yeah, that ain't no grudge. That just means shit, nigga. I ain't fucking with you. Yeah. Well, hell yeah, he yeah, is, Tina. This nigga got the Murphy, bro. Hell yeah, Noel. <laughs> <laughs> she said that nigga had three dreads. This <laughs> no, you ain't shit for that one, no. <laughs> Noel, log the fuck off, dog. <laughs> She told me that nigga had three dreads. What the fuck? She said, oh, the day before. <laughs> it's Saturday, the day before Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. Man, y'all, y'all clowning like a motherfucker. Say that nigga had three motherfucking dreads just on the back of that bed. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! But shout out to Stevie, that nigga kept the motherfucking uh Detroit motherfucking uh music going on for years and years. You understand me? Tamika, I'm sending it right now. Motown Records. To make it a 50 is cent, the 50 is cent. It's cent, my baby. See, that's how we do, man. We show love, man. We don't fuck a punk fake, man. We show love. You feel me? Y'all support us. We support y'all. We support everybody. We supporting each other. This a group of fam. We fam. Whether y'all want to be fam or not, y'all my motherfucking people. Flat out. No problem, my baby. Just say me a uh, plate of the meatballs, you know them little <laughs> meatballs <laughs> that be in the party. <laughs> That's about what they gonna have to do. some meatballs, my baby. <laughs> some of them motherfucking dinner rolls. You gonna have a pack of Hawaiian Sheena. rolls. Sheena, that what the fuck, what the hell your nephew did? Can I ask? I'm being nosy. What was the unthinkable? The unthinkable, I wanna know. If you don't wanna share it though, that's cool too. <laughs> he was silly nigga. <laughs> I'm high and hungry. Man. What the fuck you ate? Where y'all going, this motherfucker? <laughs> <laughs> I thought that thing was getting married. 
Like, shut the hell up. <laughs> hell no, nah, no. Nah. Sheena, Sheena. He, he must have fucked up. They ain't talked to four years. He fucked up. Bruh. That shit stink. Man, this shit that fire. Jimmy boy. got a whole skunk's <laughs> ass over here on the table. <laughs> Shayna? Shayna? Anybody seen Shayna? <laughs> Did she leave, y'all? Hit the like button. If you ain't hit that motherfucking like button, hit the like button one time, one time. Hit that one motherfucking time. like button. Get them likes up. JP, what up, though, my dog? Hey, man, I see you got them beautiful ass dogs, man. The motherfuckers look nice. But go down to the pen comment and motherfucking go on over to YouTube, my dog. We on YouTube right now. Subscribe and hit the motherfucking notification bell. That's what you do. Sheena's like, no, nah, I don't think I want to talk about that. Money, money, what's cracking, my dog? She's like, everybody waiting. Right, Sheena done. Sheena? Sheena got the fuck out of here. She's like, no, nope, that's too much for on the couch. Sheena was like, uh. <laughs> Not tonight. <laughs> Not tonight. <laughs> we want to know. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, everybody run up by this bitch. <laughs> What's the next topic? You tell us. We want to know, Menzo, what you, what's on your mind? I see you be putting up a lot of... All right, appreciate you, my dog. For sure, for sure. You got a topic you want to talk about? Mizzle, I see you be going through a lot of shit over there. You be putting up a lot of shit on your posters, my baby. Let's talk about it. Uh-oh. Since, uh -oh, since, since you, you want to talk, let's talk about it. You want to talk about it? <laughs> yes, Sheena, the three dreads. Right. Now, what's the unthinkable, Sheena? Right. Back to that. <laughs> we ha 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 about the three dreads already. <laughs> Let's get deep, my baby. Cause that sounded deep. The unthinkable. Is there anything y'all wanna know? Anything y'all wanna know about us? Anything y'all wanna, you feel me? We can go there. Don't be shy. Y'all be acting like y'all shy and shit cause we on YouTube, man. I told y'all we could talk more shit on here. We could talk more shit. You know what I'm saying, man? Do you understand, know man? What you mean, spaz out? Explain. Explain yourself, Miss Mizzle. She said, I have an anger problem. That sound more like a, uh, and when I don't get my way, I spaz out. Hmm. Are you receiving uh, proper meat? Tina say I can <laughs> relate. All right, so since y'all two is on the same page, uh, one thing I want to know. I think that's most people. I was just about to say. <laughs> hey, y'all ever been through anger management class? Right, so break down what y'all mean when y'all say y'all spaz out, though. Duh. What is your spaz out? You talking about hollering, cussing? Or you talking about putting hands on people? Booga -boo -boo -boo. <laughs> <laughs> For real, like, you got to be a little more... See, look, yeah, me too. That's it. Most people, especially... Men, men just show it in a different way. Women show that shit. You see it all over their face, everything. Like, men be more like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, most people, when they don't get their way, they tend to be angry. Their energy be down. Or oh, act shit. funny like, yeah, shit. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. But that's normal human that's behavior. Normal shit. So when y'all say spaz out, you got to be as specific. It's, yeah, because spaz now, nigga, mean the nigga. I'm about to tell the... The walls down in mm -hmm. this bitch. <laughs> we about to move some furniture. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we finna move some furniture in this bitch. <laughs> yeah. That's what we finna do. Shit, no way. Well, I done been through four anger management courses in my life. 
Yeah. And, and it kind of helped me out. You know what I'm saying? It balanced me out a little bit after the fourth one. <laughs> Took a little time, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, seen it. Oh, damn. Got my brother kid. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. Sorry yeah, to hear that, that Sorry to hear that, Sheena. Damn, that is the unthinkable. Shit. Purposely he did? Well, it must be if she ain't talking to him. Damn. That's fucked up. Sorry to hear that. Wow. He a piece of shit for doing that. Mm, mm, mm. I see. Well, you probably ain't gonna never talk to him no more, but you know what? God might put it on your heart to forgive him one day. But I'm sure as of right now, you don't want to talk to him about shit. Right, right, right. No, can't nobody dictate how long you're gonna be angry. Exactly. And you know what I'm saying? But don't. Exactly. Just, I don't even know what to say about that. That's some deep shit right there. <clears throat> stay, stay away from me, my nigga. Right. I don't want to talk to you at no family function. When you get there, I'm leaving. Because I ain't no telling what I do. That you know what I'm saying? she never get over that. That's what I'm saying. No telling what I do. You right. coming to the family right. function, I'm out of here. Right. Come on, kids. Get Hey, y'all ready? I don't care I'm, how much fun y'all Get your have. raps. Get your raps. I'm out of here. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Mm -hmm. That's fucked up. Your sibling love different. You know what I'm saying? You done got my motherfucking brother killed, you piece of shit motherfucker. Right. I don't even know what right. happened, but if she feel like that, god damn it, we riding with you. We shit. riding, we riding. Damn. But one thing about that karma. It comes back. It come back. God. It definitely come back, good or bad. Hell, no, I don't invite him to the family function. Oh, that's what it is? That's what I am, Shiny. What? Most folks who get angry and then get tame when they have their way are called passive aggressive. Mm-hmm. I guess that would be me. <laughs> That's a good question, Tina. It was his dad. Was who is that? She said her nephew got her brother killed. Oh damn, hell yeah. Yeah. Or yeah, was it his dad or his, or his dad uncle? Or... It had to be his dad or his uncle. Either or. I like my way. I ain't gonna lie. Well, it's gonna be my motherfucking way. I'm just gonna have to agree with your way sometime too, but it gotta be my way too. That's the only way you're gonna be able to move forward. You gotta get each other the our way sometime. Exactly. Know? Exactly, Mika. Yes, yes it is. Yes it is. Yeah, recognizing the problem. That's the first step. Yeah. And most people don't even That's know they the got a problem. That's the most important step. <laughs> yeah, most people don't even know. They, they act like they don't know they got a problem. Yeah. So that's why it be hard for motherfuckers to address their they situation. That's why they go into class thinking that's some bullshit. My way or the highway. See, yeah, Miss Mills, you can't be like that, my baby. <laughs> Shit, your way or the highway, you going to get left on the highway. <laughs> Cause I'd be like, if you wanna go, baby, <laughs> go ahead and walk out the door. One thing that you gotta remember, one money don't start no show. This train gonna keep on rolling. Oh yeah. Yeah, <laughs> gotta go. Got to go. Bye bye. She's talking about that wave. You see me? <laughs> see you later, my baby. <laughs> I missed y'all yesterday. Though. I wish y'all could have been with us at the goddamn movie premiere. Though. Oh, man. Now the band ain't gonna lie. We had a good ass time. For real, for real. And I can't wait till July the 2nd to see y'all turn up at this barbecue, talk some shit, build. You know what I mean? Get to know each other a little more. 
And playing some more shit after that. They know they wrong as fuck. Uh, man. People just don't want to be wrong. I was just about to say they that. They just don't want to be wrong. Even like you say, even when they know they wrong. It's just like a motherfucker that hate losing. They hate to be wrong. It's the same shit. Getty, what up, though, my dog? I'm sorry, Candace. Getty, what's good, my dog? Shout out to my nigga Getty 808. Shout out, Getty. He actually scored the motherfucking movie. You feel me? That nigga did a lot of work for that movie as well. Getty, we been in here talking about the movie and shit. The premiere, we was telling him how loud that motherfucker was. Yes, sir. How nice yes, it sir. was. That shit came together very well. Again, I can't keep talking about it enough, y'all. I'm sorry. Yeah, but motherfuckers don't want to hold themselves accountable. When they wrong, when they know they wrong, they're going to still try to figure out a way to make you feel like they right in some type of way. So it's best not to even argue. That's how arguments get started. I mean, that's how arguments carry on. Because the motherfuckers steady trying to prove to you how right they is. And you feel me? You trying to prove to them how wrong they is. That's how the argument carry on. Oh, yeah, Miss Martin. You already know we going to turn up, my baby. Motherfucking just last second. Just last second, we throwing a motherfucking picnic on the couch after motherfucking work picnic. If you bellin' fucking been tuning in, then you motherfucking got it in your holodex. God damn me. If you don't, then you motherfucking need to put it there because that's where you need to be or you bellin' fucking have your ass square. So yeah, if y'all want to see some of that behind the scenes footage, it's a video up on, on, this, uh, on this page. Just go back a video and it's on there. Y'all see about 20 minutes of, you know, good footage from the movie. You heard me? And you can go check it out. June 1st on Tubi. And that shit is pretty good. Trust me, we're going to do a goddamn recap of it once it come out again. That's right, Miss Martin. Getty, can you send me a beat, man? You know the type of tip I'm on. Can you send me something, man? I want to sing, man. I need some trap R&B, bro. Give me some trap R&B. You know what I mean? You back in Facebook Damn, jail? Fuck Facebook. See? That's why we on YouTube, bro. Because Facebook That's keep what I'm talking about, Getty. That's some bullshit, bro. That's some bullshit, dog. And they be reporting like, it's like, damn, y'all throw a nigga in jail for the dumbest shit, Facebook. So fuck you. We are live on YouTube. Mm-hmm. You feel me? With damn near the same numbers. When they let us back in, we gonna go in there and direct the rest of our traffic over here because there's still some of us missing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's yeah. all right, though. Definitely got to do that. Katori, how you doing tonight? Go on down to the pin comment. Come on over to YouTube. Subscribe and hit the right. notification Click the link. bell. We right there on YouTube right now. We ain't trying to fuck with Facebook no more. Click the link on goddamn YouTube at the bottom. YouTube like us a little more over here. E V me. We can talk our <laughs> shit. You V me. B. I heard they having a freak nick this year. Where? In, in Atlanta. Is that true, anybody? Y'all know anything about a freak nick this year in Atlanta? Mm -hmm. Let's see. I ain't heard about that one. I did. Let's see. Motherfucking freak. If they bring the freak nick back in these time and ages, it ain't going to be the same. I'm just saying from experience, it ain't gonna be the same. You say they try to bring that shit back <laughs> every year. <laughs> <laughs> so you try to bring it back every year? Uh-huh. So that mean it might be some bullshit then. We gonna have an on the couch after work freak Nate. <laughs> <laughs> We gonna shut the streets down and turn up. <laughs> Where should get damn over there? Oh shit, that shit about to go. <laughs> shit about to die. She to my own the couch free, Nick. I think you own something. Tina, get your little hot and ready ass. Your little hot and ready ass. <laughs> 
Hey, y'all, if you ain't hit that motherfucking like button, I'm getting mad than the motherfucker. Hit that like button one time. If you ain't already, all you got to do is hit it one time, then you ain't got to mm -hmm. hit it no more. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. If they going to let you hit it a million times, just hit it that one time. You feel me? And you done for the night. And you done for the night, that's all. You could just sit back, relax, watch the show. Hit you know that motherfucking man? like button, man. Now, uh, what's on y'all mind? <laughs> Anybody got so, something on their mind? Did y'all tell Mark Zuckerberg and his goons what's on y'all mind all the motherfucking time? Yeah, y'all always tell Facebook. Might as well tell us mind. what's on y'all mind. What's on y'all mind right now? Yeah, that's a good question, Jimmy. What's on y'all mind, <laughs> goddamn? Put your post up here on the comment section right now. Put your post up there. Put it in the comment section. If you section. was posting on Facebook right now, put your post up. Put your post up. Tell me, Tell me what's up, my baby. Tonight. We still have block parties. Good question. I ain't seen a block party in a long time. I mean, friend. they do. I done been to a couple, but it ain't, ain't what shit What you fucking eating, man? You can't candy, man. I knew it. Look. <laughs> I swear to God, I knew it, dog. I seen free candy, I so I said. The old people downstairs be putting it out there. London be fucking that shit up. <laughs> Good looking. They were real. She told me, no, they had Glock parties. Glock parties. <laughs> yeah. Damn. You okay. ain't never lied. I ain't when been to one in a minute. That's just how that bitch was, but I wasn't tripping shit because I had mine on me, too. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody else said that, Candace. Do a pop up shot. I have to give it my nigga Chucky, I man. And I like that too, though, for real. Where's the festival? Yeah, I miss the festivals in Hot Plaza. Oh, she said they bringing them back. They is? I didn't know that. They need to. Mm -hmm. They need to, man. That shit used to be nice back in the day. And this shit is more people with more money now, so bring that shit back. So a nigga can get robbed. <laughs> <laughs> All them concerts and shit they used to they have, bring that pop. shit back. They <laughs> better not, man. They better not fucking. They better not fuck down. Man, time, this bro. is Detroit, dog. Auto show coming in September. Where it's coming to? Back in the original spot? Shit, I doubt that. Man, that shit, hey, Tina, that shit ain't that easy, my baby. It ain't. That shit take a lot of uh, hard yeah. work, money, sponsorship. That shit take, nah, that shit take some money, money yeah, right Yeah, we there. need big sponsorship with that. Be able to do a musical festival. I shit. just look like this. I ain't got a whole lot of money. <laughs> 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 See, the thing we rich around right, this yeah, bitch. <laughs> Fuck that. I need we sponsors, rich, Tina. I don't Tina. like spending my money. I like spending other people's money. <laughs> When it comes to shit like that, if you finna do some shows, we gonna get their money and spend it. Them big sponsors and shit. We ain't coming out of our pocket a little bit. We come out with a little bit, but shit. Uh -huh. Tina, yeah, I, hey, easier said than done. And right. I, I ain't really got the time. You know what I'm saying? It take a big team to do that type of shit. Exactly. Cause I don't have time to do everything. Like you know, that shit take shit. Yeah, bringing the fireworks back, yeah. They, this I'm telling you, this summer gonna be the most littest, craziest mm -hmm. summer we can had. These oh, it's definitely going down this summer. They can't wait. Monday through Sunday gonna be jumping. If you grown, and you motherfucking got your CPL, good. If you don't got your CPL, go and you ain't it. got no felonies, you better go get you it. better go get a CPL. Cause man, waiting on the motherfucking police ain't gonna be the way to go. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? The motherfuckers gonna take too long and a lot of shit can happen. Mm-hmm. Yeah, them fireworks gonna be a motherfucker this year. I'm telling y'all, be prepared. It's gonna be a ho hopefully it don't be no bullshit going down this so summer. It's gonna be a good runner and a good dodger at Block Party. <laughs> good place to get a gun, reasonable. Man, everything high can be. <coughs> it's gonna spend you fifteen hundred. <laughs> no, no. Hit, hit, hit my, hit, step in my office, Candace. You know what I'm saying? I'll get you together, my baby. Shit. I forgot this was the gunman over Shit, here. Shit, I got you. I, 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 I'll lead you to a couple of places where they, they reasonable instead of the highest action, action, hiding a motherfucker, man. Mm -hmm. 
She got a nine. She wants something smaller. You need a 40, a small 40. Fuck, you want something smaller, folks. You want something bigger. Dad, get top by a hot girl or something for sure. Oh, Lord Jesus. See? Look at you. You got a baby. You can't hot girl nothing. Right. Where the baby go be at? I just thought about it. <laughs> right, you gonna be sitting your ass down titty feeding. What you talking about, hot girl summer? No way of saying you'll be dead longer than you you'll gotta be do it alive. With the Damn. Live your life. That's my status for the night. Man, what? <laughs> Damn, that's some real shit. You'll be dead longer than you're gonna be alive. Damn. Live your life. That's some real shit right there, Noel. Gibraltar still open. Hell, Hell no. Hell no, Gibraltar ain't still open. Shit, white boy Rick brought that bitch and turned it to us. A weed Dispensary uh, facility. Yeah, like a fucking grow house. They grow they weed. They smoke they weed. They sell they weed. It's all weed. <laughs> it's all in the same facility. <laughs> Tell me, talking about, yeah, straight hot girl something. Sit down, Grandma. Sit your ass down, Auntie Tammy. <laughs> no, that's Grandma Tammy. Yeah, sit your ass down. Ain't no sit hot down, girl Grandma. Summer. Hot Grandma Summer. <laughs> Them goddamn grandbabies got <laughs> Fuck you talking about hot girl summer. Y'all cloudy, boy. Y'all motherfuckers can't wait to get that sun on your skin all week long, 80 to 90 degrees. I'm telling you this, y'all, they gonna be out here every day. Ain't gonna be like, remember how it used to be like just the weekend? Nah, these motherfuckers about to hey, be out day, here. I can't day. wait to get off work. I, nigga, it's hot outside. <laughs> so weed is legal. Yes, it is, Tina. Weed is totally legal. Yeah, in, it's legal here. In here. State of Michigan. You see how we be getting high as fuck? You know we love you, Tammy. It ain't nothing but you just... Get to my New Year's baby. We just be joking, that's all. Y'all can't wait to get cute. Y'all want y'all little sandals and all that little shit. Y'all cannot wait. Got that motherfucker. Shea butter. Shea butter right on deck for them feet. <laughs> Cause if you got bold feet and you come around Jimmy, I'ma be all in your ass about the motherfucker. You better not have that me. white part on the back of your foot. Right. That hard part. That shit better not Looking be white. Like them bitches need to be scrubbed. They ain't been scrubbed all winter. <laughs> she took my mama already five down pound and five pound pound pound. <laughs> yeah, we gonna get out here a little bit this summer here and then. <laughs> <laughs> the big truck family. <laughs> she told me, speaking of grandmas, why you think those young grandmas trying to babysit while they have a hot girl or something? Because that's what you're supposed to do as a grandma. That's your job. Not to yeah. babysit, but to be a grandma. Well, you Not big be... mom now. Yeah, ain't no being fast. Grandma wasn't that Bella. Yeah, I and forgot she... to make a grandma too. She wasn't out there hanging and dangling. <laughs> Right. You feel me? Having drinks at floods and shit. She was at home being grandma. <laughs> at, baking. At trying to get a picture at views yeah. and shit. <laughs> you got to put your gown on and walk around the house and hum. You a grandma now. Mm -hmm. Linda Ross say she just came from Miami. It was nice. That's what's up, Linda. You ain't bring us nothing back? You ain't bring us nothing back. You ain't stingy ass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Shiny, I hear you, my baby. See, my grandma was definitely baking. That's what I'm saying. Grandmas be baking, man. With the gown and blouse or blouse on. You feel me? With them little ugly ass house shoes. Right. And she be humming them songs. Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I walk around the house, huh? That's what I'm saying, though. Y'all know that shit true. <laughs> oh, damn. That's my birthday, September 24th, Candy. 
Is it any grill grandmas in here that bake? Is any grandmas in here that bake? Tamika, Hell Tammy, nah. do y'all bake cookies and shit for the kids? Hell no. Nah. And make cakes from scratch? You a grandma? <laughs> they off the back of the Listen, box on that. Bitch. My grandma used to bake a cake for me every year on my birthday. How many of y'all grandma baked that cake for you on your birthday though? Don't come in this bitch line, especially if I know you. You know what I'm talking about? Don't come in this motherfucking line. Shit, I'ma know if you bake some shit. Cause if you talking about you a, ba a hell of a baker and, and I ain't ain't nothing, then uh, right, motherfucker. Talking about the grandma's not that old these days. Grandma's cooking noodles <laughs> and hot pockets <laughs> <laughs> from scratch. You want a juicy juice? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like grandma used to bake like a motherfucker, sugar cookies, peanut butter cookies. That's fucked up. All that up, type of man. shit. You know what I'm saying? That's fucked up, dog. I guess times have changed. Times have really I changed. I do. I be watching YouTube videos. <laughs> so my, now, now sat down. <laughs> sat your ass down. <laughs> <laughs> that shit fire. Whatever, motherfucker. Ain't motherfucker came with not one cookie. What y'all know about it? Them good old Chico sticks. What y'all know about it? Them good old Chico sticks. I need six of these bitches right now, though, low key. Y'all be baby this shit out them grandbabies too right now. <laughs> Give me my baby. <laughs> Snacks. <laughs> mm -hmm. I ain't baking shit. What y'all want from the store? Shit, I buy it. <laughs> Grandma, go home and bake some shit. Hell nah. Shit, I'm trying to twerk. They got a new TikTok out. <laughs> TikTok and granny. <laughs> TikTok and grannies around this bitch. <laughs> Times we live in there, boy. This shit is a motherfucker. You understand me? Yes, it is. Shit, where is that at? I ain't seen none of that. <laughs> You to my peach cobbler and pies. <laughs> right. That's for you. That ain't for the goddamn kids. <laughs> oh, What's your favorite What's little your Debbie? Favorite? Little Debbie oatmeal snack. pies. Yeah, the oatmeal cream pies. Yeah, oatmeal cream pies. Other than that, that's your horrible. <laughs> that's commissary. Or well, honey bun. Or honey bun. Shit. Oh, that's your favorite. Them the best two things Lil Debbie got. Yep, they was 10 cent. Them bitches a quarter now. When I do catch them though, I buy the whole fucking th tray of them bitches. Pecan rolls. Them was good too. Talk about Warmed up. Frozen pies from Kroger. I'm trying to act like she been <laughs> You baked the frozen pies? You ain't baked shit. You heated that bitch up. <laughs> you heated it up. On 375. <laughs> Hey, look, y'all, I made y'all a pie. Granny did that. <laughs> hey, listen, take one of them honey buns and put some ice cream on top of that bitch. Lord, <laughs> I think Jesus made that himself. Hell, fuck yeah. Man, hell, fuck yeah. Talk about the directions say bake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no shit. They put the oven on bake. <laughs> <laughs> you in that cheapness system. Y'all baked this pie, you heated that pie up. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's like a, uh, the pies, them like uh, TV dinners. That's a TV dinner pie. 
Oh, Bill Pines for the win. Ladies, ladies, I want to know, uh, do you got some type of feeling in your ass? Because y'all love when a nigga grab your ass and just... <laughs> What's the feeling in that ass you get when I grab? What's the feeling in that ass when I grab? <laughs> we want to know because we fellas, you know what I'm saying? We just technically speaking. Technically. You know what I'm saying? I got a good question. After y'all answer that one, I like it massaged. Most women like their ass massaged. That's what I'm talking about. Right, so what feeling is that? What That's feeling? Just like, what feeling? Do y'all be getting wet when y'all get y'all ass rubbed? Be honest. Don't, yes. don't don't be lying. What is it triggering off for you? I think I think that's how the, the, the booty massage turned into a fuck because y'all little pussies be getting wet from that shit. Am I lying? Stop me when I'm lying. Stop me when I'm lying. We want to know. Yep. See, look, I knew it. I knew it. That's that's a sexual act. Listen, a booty rub is a sexual act. Point blank, period. Ain't no way you can massage no woman's ass and you ain't getting a hard on. So, the question is, is that part of full play? No, that's part of less play. <laughs> That's less play. You want to ask massage? Oh yeah, you want to play. You want to play. Yeah, you want to play. Shiny say that motherfucker booty rub Pussy definitely get the engine running. Man, what? <laughs> say crank that motherfucker up. <clears throat> For real. <laughs> That pussy got over 30,000 miles. Make sure you warm it up first. <laughs> Damn, Patrick Gass, goddammit. You know what you gotta do for those who, the original members, you know what you, you gotta warm it up. Put some WD-40 on that bitch. Bibs, what up, dude? What's cracking, my dog? We over here on YouTube, you know what I'm talking about? Just having a good old time with our cows potatoes. You know what I'm saying? Fuck a Facebook. They can kiss my ass. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what you been into, my dog? Man. Y'all know I'm only telling the truth. That's why y'all laughing like that. That's all I'm saying. Y'all motherfucker got, y'all get that motherfucker right. You know what I'm saying? Shit. Can't just go right on in like nigga young and shit. Let me stick it right in. Shit, she go, hold on, hold on, young man. I gotta let it warm up first. <laughs> like, all right, grandma. God damn. The fuck? <laughs> How many weed heads I got out there? If you smoke weed, say you do. If you don't, say you don't. But if you do, I got a special gift for you. July the motherfucking second at the motherfucking picnic for on the motherfucking couch after work. You understand me? We gonna be high. So if you smoke this good ganja like I do, let me know in the motherfucking comments. And I got something special just for you. You understand me? I'm known as Mr. 31 Flavors in the motherfucking hood. You understand me? Say a pen, Tina. What the hell? Yeah, Mika, I know you do. <laughs> Miss or you don't. Ain't nothing wrong with that, my baby. Sometimes it be like that, you know what I'm saying? What happened? 
Tammy says she's smoking right now. No, I told him I got something special for him July the 2nd at the motherfucking picnic. You know what I'm saying? Good motherfucking ganja. We gonna be high as shit. But I only got two smokers so far. Mm-mm. Tina says she smoke occasionally. She probably go smoke when she get here, though. Hell yeah, Noel. <laughs> Say like an old Mark Chevy. <laughs> all right, Wendy. All right, Sheena. Yep, yep, yep. I got y'all. I got y'all. Don't forget. Don't forget July the 2nd. Bring your kids out. We gonna have a nice event go down. You understand me? Right. Fuck y'all doing up late. Y'all ain't got to work. <laughs> <coughs> Motherfuckers ain't got to work. <laughs> Boy. Oh, no, 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 no. What time is it? 11.40? <coughs> it's time to go. Mm-mm-mm. Trying to go, y'all. It is getting late. You know, we had to come in this motherfucker and do what we had to do. You hear me? Yeah, I understand. Remember, y'all, support your motherfucking own people. Stay consistent at whatever you doing. If you got something you want to advertise on the show, Hit us up in the DMs or y'all can call and we advertise that shit on the show. We all about uplifting our motherfucking people and growing. You know what I'm saying? We don't no negative vibes, no negative energy over here. Nothing but positive shit. July 2nd is the motherfucking picnic, y'all. July the 2nd. You heard me? And we'll see you motherfuckers tomorrow. Same time, same motherfucking place. YouTube on the couch, 10 p.m. every motherfucking night. Be here. Share Subscribe. this shit. Share it to your YouTube. I Subscribe. mean, your Facebook. Share this shit to YouTube. Share this shit to motherfucker. I mean, share this shit to motherfucker. Facebook. Share this shit to Instagram. Wherever you want to share this motherfucker to. Share this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Subscribe and hit the notification bell. You hear me? That's what I need y'all to do. We'll see you motherfuckers tomorrow. Go to fuck the bed. Y'all have a good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. But if, if they, they do, do, you better get your ass up. <laughs>